What's up everyone? Today, we're gonna to take a tour through West Haven, which is one of Franklin's most sought after communities. Um, really great place. So if you haven't heard about West Haven, you've probably been living under a rock or haven't been looking on the MLS too much for houses yet, um, but you definitely should. A lot of really cool things about West Haven and can't wait to talk about it with you. So um, if this is your first time visiting my channel, my name is Jen Gramling. I'm a realtor here in the Nashville and Williamson County and surrounding areas. Um, putting out weekly videos, just trying to help you get more familiar with Nashville and Williamson County or wherever you might be moving. If you're relocating here, this would be a great channel for you to get information. So be sure to subscribe and reach out to me with any questions. With that being said, let's go ahead and jump into talking about West Haven. Okay, so we definitely wanna take you on a little bit of a driving tour today so you can really get a sense of this community. So it's so, so beautiful. When you drive through here, it's just like Old Town Americana. So it's kind of picture perfect. If this is your style, you will absolutely love it. So this place is for front porch sitting, um, for hanging out with your neighbors, for getting to know people. West Haven just has a really strong sense of community. And as you drive through here, as you can see down some of these streets, the houses are a little bit closer together. So yeah, you're probably not gonna get a huge lot in here unless you're up into a really high price point. But what you are gonna get is just a really great sense of community. And what West Haven may be lacking as far as your yard size go, uh, they do make up for it in multiple green spaces tons of open space in here where you can go out, throw a ball, take your dogs for a walk, really get out and enjoy the outdoors, um, but not have to be the one to keep that up. And as far as amenities go, there's lots of things to do in here. So in West Haven, you've got this beautiful community center and centered in here, you've got number one, obviously these resort style pools. So you're gonna have pools, you're gonna have um, a little kid's pool with splash pad, You've got the zero entry depth pool. You have a lap pool if you're someone who wants to swim laps, um, water slides. So, um, you know, you've got all this right here in your very own neighborhood. So you don't even need to go to a resort. You don't even have to leave every day. It's kind of like a staycation in West Haven. And then in that community center, they also have art rooms where, where you as an adult or your kids can go and enjoy art classes and do things like that. And then also a really incredible fitness center. And then the residence club, as it's called, is 15,000 square feet. And that includes a 40 seat theater, a fitness room, a weight room, a movement studio, offering exercise and yoga classes, arts and craft studio, game room, and a banquet room. And then there's also going to be a 12 acre lake, community fishing ponds, parks, walking trails, a full-time activities coordinator. And then of course you have lighted tennis courts and beautiful landscaping everywhere you look, not to mention the parks. So the parks and the playgrounds, um, you're going to find those all over and they are so beautiful. Um, and just as you drive through here, all the trees, all the landscaping, it's just absolutely gorgeous. So you're not going to run out of places to go and things to do here in West Haven. And then if that wasn't enough, they are actually working on completing a second amenity center. So in that second amenity center, they're gonna have another pool with lap lanes, um, another kids area, they've got more tennis courts, and that's gonna be located right over by West Haven Golf Club. And if I didn't mention that before, it is located right by West Haven Golf Course, um, which you can go and join there as well. And you won't have far to go to then play golf. Okay, so that's a lot about the community. Now you know um, you've got a place to go, you've got things to do. So what about the houses in there? Let's take a look at those. So you're gonna have a lot of different options. You'll have flat style condos, you'll have townhouses, you've got smaller detached houses, and then you've also got really large houses with big lots. Um, so your price range in here can span. You can take advantage of this neighborhood um, if you're just one person wanting a flat condo or if you're wanting a single family home. So let's go ahead and take a look at some of these homes and the price points so you can get an idea of where you would be uh, price-wise purchasing a home here in West Haven right now. Okay, so as we head off um, to look at some of these houses, I will just say West Haven is huge. There are hundreds and thousands of houses here and not just that, um, but they are still building and they do intend to continue to build for another eight years. So you have not missed the boat on a new house here in West Haven. However, it is very competitive to get one, but it's not impossible and it can be done. So um, they will still be building. Apparently they just released or got approved another thousand lots in here. So 
Yes, they will still be building for a long time. Um, there is also a lot of resale that comes up in here. Um, so if this is a neighborhood that interests you, definitely you'll wanna jump on things as they come up um, and grab those or just be aware of the new builds that are coming here. So, and to touch on that a little bit with the new builds, you can't just buy a lot and build on one in here right now because of the issues with pricing lumber and things like that. Um, they're only building spec homes right now. So they'll release those once they get to right around the drywall stage, right after framing, so that they can price that lumber a little bit better. And then once they release those, they release them uh, more like a resale home. So right now there are, you know, still bids being taken, um, highest offer received for these homes in West Haven. So it's still working a little bit like a resale. You can't just go in and put a deposit on a lot. That's something you need to know about buying a new build in West Haven right now. But again, not impossible. It can definitely be done. So be sure and ask any of those questions. I'm happy to help answer any of those. And also, we don't want to forget the town center. So not only is West Haven just an amazing place to live, you've got your parks and your residence club, your pools and your tennis courts, but you've also got a great little town center that has literally everything you need. And not to mention your school is in here as well, but there is so much to offer down here in this little downtown. You can bring your golf cart, drive your golf cart down here, run and get your groceries or run and get a bite to eat. Um, so just some of the places down here in this little town center. And you know, this really kind of reminds me of like a beach town or, or a cute little mountain chalet town. So, so some of the places that they've got down here, just to name a few, are Highbrow Coffee and Tea, Oscar's Taco Shop, Scout's Pub, Kate and Lulu's kitchen, you've got Ching Asian Bistro, Front Street Tavern, and Sweet Haven. Not to mention you're going to have financial services places, CPA, you've got salons and booksellers, flowers and gifts. You really have everything you need right here and a Kroger, of course. So you can just pop down here on your golf cart and grab your groceries, your bottle of wine, or whatever you're gonna need. And if you wanna venture further out, you can, but if you don't feel like going far, it's just as easy to hop in your golf cart and come down here, have your quick dinner, bite to eat and drink, and, and then head on home, or just walk. Okay, so let's take a look at some of the condos and some of the townhomes that you can buy here. So you've actually got some of these condo flats that you can purchase in here that are very close to the town center. Um, so you've got more of that city living aspect, but you're more in this residential community where you get to take advantage of all the benefits of being here in West Haven, but still have the walkability of being in a downtown city. So in the last few months, there haven't been a ton of condo sales, but the ones that have sold have been somewhere in the $450,000 range, all the way up to the $700,000 range. Um, you should see the insides of these are absolutely beautiful. So the square footage on these can range anywhere from 1,500 square feet up to 2,100 square feet, and maybe two bedrooms, two bath, to three bedroom, two bath. So there hasn't been a whole lot of resale for these in the last six months, but they do occasionally pop up, and what a cool place to be if you're in a condo. These are amazing. Okay, and then we can move into some of the townhouses. So there's lots of super cute townhouses in here. Prices on those are gonna range somewhere and they've been selling anywhere from about 420,000 all the way up to about 650,000. And those seem to be a little bit more plentiful than the flat condos. So there are some more of these that have been coming up for resale. These are super cute. Again, you get that same benefit of being right here in West Haven. And then these townhomes are gonna range somewhere from about the 1,400 square feet up to probably 2,000 square feet or so. And you've got all different styles of these townhomes. You've got lots of them to choose from. They're really, really cute. And I just love how much charm and character these townhomes have in West Haven. Okay, and then you're gonna get into your single family homes. And your single family homes can really range in here. So you can start maybe somewhere in the 2,000 square foot all the way up to 8,000 square feet. So when you're looking in here, you're looking at resale, your smaller homes, your 2,000 square feet, you can be three bedroom, two bath, up to four bedroom, three bath. And those sales as of recently have typically been right around the mid 600,000 range, anywhere up into the even $800,000 range. Once you get 
up to that 3,000 square foot mark. It'll start to go up starting more in the eight and $900,000. These are, as I said before, very competitive to get one of these houses, especially in this mid range, 2,500 square feet to 3,500 square feet. These are just in really high demand. So a lot of people want to move to West Haven. A lot of people see the value in the charm in it. So it is going to be competitive. So you need to keep that in mind when you're trying to get one of these houses. And as I mentioned before, with the new construction, these fall into kind of that same resale category. So they're releasing these onto the MLS. They accept all offers by a certain time and you can put in your highest and best bid and hopefully you will be that winning bid. You put your best foot forward and what you feel like that house is worth to you to have and hopefully then you can have that house. So then you're gonna move up into the even larger houses. When you're in that 3,500 square foot range, you're gonna be closer to a million and going up from there. So we've even had sales in here in the last six months or so, 5,000 square foot homes approximately and those are in the $1.4, $1.5,000 dollar range, all the way up to $1.8. And I believe one just recently closed for $2.3 million, if I'm not mistaken. So price is really going up around here, as with everywhere else in the country. But as you can see, I mean, you really are getting a beautiful, well-built home for your money. These houses are gorgeous. The community is great. Um, you're not going to be able to beat some of these community events that they have. Fourth of July here is amazing. Picnics and get-togethers, hanging out with your neighbors. These are all of the great things that come in living in West Haven. It's just a really, I can't say it enough, a really great place to be. And people who live here absolutely love it. As you can see driving through here, really, really, really cute, cute neighborhood. I love it in here. So that's going to wrap it up for our tour of West Haven. Okay, so that's West Haven. Isn't it so cute? What a great place to live. Um, so again, my name is Jen Grambling. I'm a realtor here in the Nashville, Williamson County and surrounding area. I'm just putting out these weekly videos to help you get more familiar with Nashville if you're relocating or moving here and looking for that perfect neighborhood for you. I'm trying to help you find that through these videos. So if you find this helpful, be sure to subscribe, hit the like button, um, watch for the next videos to come out. If there's any neighborhoods that you wanna see, be sure to drop those in the comments so I can try to get out and video those as well. And again, if you have any questions at all about moving, be sure to reach out to me. You can reach me by text, email, phone call, however you wanna reach out to me, just be sure and do that. And I'm happy to answer any and all of your questions in regards to moving. So that'll wrap it up for West Haven. Thanks so much and I'll see you on the next video.